first call came in at approximately 10 o'clock this morning. It was a recorded carbon monoxide with patients. Mm -hmm. So that was the response by fire and EMS. Yeah. And we so? had uh, reported three students feeling dizzy and nauseous. Were they all in one area of the school? Or? They were in one area of the school. Uh, and at this point, we're still investigating as to the potential cause. So those three students that initially felt sick, was it all the same, are they all in the same class? They were all in the same classroom. So what are you finding so far? At this point, uh, they're still investigating the entire school. We still don't have any determination uh, of what caused this event. Are they able to run a sniffer of some sort around They are uh, investigating with uh, detectors, trying to determine oxygen levels, carbon monoxide levels, etc. Did anything hit initially? Like, did you get a carbon monoxide alarm quickly? I have not talked to the uh, interior response team. I don't know what they have come up with at this point. So what are we seeing happen over here then? At, at this point, uh, we've had 10 people transported to the medical center, 18 transported to medical center of the Rockies. Uh, these students behind us over here in the staging area, they're being evaluated by paramedics to determine if they need to be transported to area hospitals for further evaluation. Uh, we've also had five people transported to Poudre Valley Hospital by Fort Collins. That's a lot of, I mean, the numbers are, are high. How severe is their illness? At this point, all the, uh, what we've determined is that these are non-life-threatening, that these are not severe uh, illnesses at this point. Feeling okay. nauseous and dizzy, yes. Did you split them up between the hospitals for a reason? To not overload the hospitals, that's why they were uh, split up. When you see something like this go on, what's the first priority for you guys? Or sort of the, the top thing as you're trying to figure out how to manage a large situation like this? The first, first priority is trying to uh, evaluate and determine the, the number of people that have been exposed and provide the medical treatment they need. The secondary at that point then is to determine the cause. It's hard to see all these kids feeling bad. Uh, I can't answer that You one. know what I mean? I mean, it's just, I don't know, it's a bunch of kids outside their school going, why do we feel sick? Uh, I, I can't answer that. So, Merlin, if it is carbon monoxide, would they smell something? Carbon monoxide is odorless, so no, they would not smell anything. And I did hear uh, an unconfirmed report oh, really? that there was an odor, but again, that's unconfirmed, and I don't know where that information came from. Well, we are okay. smelling a treatment plant right now. The treatment plant is directly to the south of us. Were any adults overcome? Yes. My understanding is there were three adults that have been transported, but to which hospital I don't know. And the rest are students? Numbers. They were among these numbers that I provided to teachers. I do not know. And the rest were students? The rest were all students. Broad age range, age range, or do you know? I do not have the ages. Can you talk to me about if it is carbon monoxide? What are some of the dangers of carbon monoxide? Uh, well, obviously the dangers of carbon monoxide uh, at night it's called the silent killer because it lulls you to sleep. And it displaces oxygen in the body. So, uh, but early onset is just some of the symptoms that were described today: nausea, dizziness, headache, those types of things. When you guys go in there and start investigating where this is coming from, what are the key places they look? The first places are good. Well, you, we're, we're obviously going to the room of origin uh, and surrounding areas, but typically we'll be looking at the HVAC systems heating systems, anything that's producing uh, combustion. Carbon monoxide is a byproduct of combustion, so those are what we'd be looking for, any triggers. Has the school been um, searched for any kind of